Are we going to go live here, phone? I think I'm getting the notification of me being live on my email before the actual phone goes live. I also fear for um, the audio sync issues that we had last time, because I am using that specific phone that gave us the audio sync issues. So if we do get audio sync issues, please bear with it. There's not a whole lot I can do about it, because I want to deliver you guys at least as clean of an audio as I can, considering the location that I'm in. But anyway, shields up, Iron Breakers. How's everybody doing? Um, I'm at the house. Uh, I left a little bit earlier from the office today so that I could um, go ahead and set up because I'm going to go hang out with a couple of friends tonight. So I wanted to um, I want to talk to you guys just a little bit before I get out of the house here. Uh, unfortunately, I got to the house. My wife and my kid, they were leaving. They were going out with uh, the in-laws. They were going out on a walk and stuff. Um, so, yeah, basically I come early to the home and I'm here all alone. I'm all alone. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Anyway, uh, real quick, a couple of things that I wanted to address. Uh, I mean, obviously, like I said, uh, at the end of today's uh, Tokiden 2 stream, uh, I'm going to stop streaming Toki then too because I just feel that uh, most of the audience of my channel is just not very interested in Toki then two uh, in a Toki then two playthrough. So uh, that is something that I need to pay more attention to because up until this point, since YouTube was not my main source of revenue, I never really had to worry about the content that I was doing that much. I was like, well, if people don't like it, they won't watch it. I just want to play something. And now I have to be a little bit more, um, a little bit smarter about that. Um, so Toki then to, uh, we have like six episodes, I think. Uh, I might be doing a, um, a live stream, not, not a live stream, I might be doing a review or something when I eventually uh, finish, because I do want to finish that game. So we'll see how that works out. Uh, another topic that I wanted to talk about is Persona 5 because there's still a lot of people asking me about Persona 5 and let me tell you guys about Persona 5. It's like I've been checking every day uh, on the Atlas website. I'm not even kidding. I've checked every single day to see if they uh, change the um, dumb policy that they have on live streams and it hasn't happened. It hasn't happened. So for those of you that aren't aware, the reason why there's no more uh, episodes of Persona 5 is because Atlas doesn't want it. And they will strike you down with, with the full might of their copyright dick if you try and um, live stream it on YouTube. And we all know how good YouTube is about copyright and enforcing copyright regardless of fair use or any other... Um, or anything else um, that you try to pull on YouTube. It's basically extremely strict, so I'm pretty sure that Atlas could do whatever the fuck they want uh, if they want to dick somebody over on YouTube. So that's the reason why I'm not going to uh, do Persona 5 as well. Um, and as a matter of fact, I've, the reason I've been checking all these days is because I've been hoping against hope that I would be able to resume my playthrough, and that hasn't happened. So from this point onward, I'm just going to be I'm going to start playing Persona by myself and eventually the, the next piece of content you will see on Persona for me is probably going to be a review when I eventually finish it. Uh, so that's Toki then too, uh, and that's Persona. All Thicks, what about Andromeda playthrough? Dude, the playthrough is there. It's done. Like, haven't you seen? There is a full playthrough of Mass Effect Andromeda in the channel. Like, that's already done. Uh, in case you haven't checked, you just look Andromeda on my channel, you'll find it. Um, continuing, I wanted to talk about uh, tomorrow, I want to be playing some Shovel Knight. So that's probably the plan for tomorrow. I'm curious to see if you guys are going to enjoy that or not. So we will see what comes out of that. Um, once I start live, I'm not exactly sure what time I'll be live tomorrow. Probably some point after lunch, I think. Because tomorrow is Saturday, and Saturdays and Sundays I kind of have to have a little bit of a different schedule for myself so again I can spend time with family do that kind of stuff but um, yeah tomorrow the plan is to stream Shovel Knight we shall see if that is a thing or not uh, depending on attendance on how much people enjoy it views all that stuff we will see um, if um, we'll see if I will be able to play the entirety of Shovel Knight or if we move onwards to another project 
We still have the um, Souls, the Ironbreaker Souls thing that I also want to do. Uh, that is probably right after Shovel Knight. Uh, another game that I want to try out is also... Uh, I'm not sure if you guys are interested in that or not, but considering that you wanted me to play through uh, Resident Evil 7, this might be something you guys um, like as well, which is Little Nightmares. Uh, and I'm, and I'm, by the way, I'm talking about all these things. If you're watching the video after the live stream, like I want feedback on these topics that I'm expressing here. Um, but Little Nightmares is, a, is an interesting game by... Uh, I'm not sure who the developer is of it, but it's being published by Bandai Namco. And it looks pretty cool. I, I got a review code, but I can't stream it yet, so I can't show you guys uh, the game yet. And I was thinking whether or not I should be playing it blind, because usually that's the, the way you guys kind of like when, they, when I do a playthrough. You like it when I do it blind, and I don't know what the hell is happening. Because if I already know what is happening, then it, it's clearly not as entertaining. Um, but... Yeah, that's another title that I'm interested in checking out. I believe the embargo lifts about a week from now, uh, at which point I would be able to stream it for you guys. Uh, so that is, again, one of those games that I'm thinking about putting on the channel. And the other thing that I already know that a lot of you guys want is Rush of Blood. Until Dawn, Rush of Blood is another VR horror game. For some reason, I think you guys are really into watching me play horror games. I think that's a vestige of me playing Dead Space like, a lot of you guys really enjoyed it when I played Dead Space back in the day, and I'm assuming that's why you would want uh, more horror stuff. But, yeah, I can I can do Rush of Blood. I'm assuming Rush of Blood is probably something that you could do in, like, one session. Um, Carl, I already have, I already have that. I'm, I have access to that, but thanks. I appreciate it. But as I, as I was saying, uh, Rush of Blood is probably something that I could do in one session, so probably at some point next week we could, uh, we could do it. <clears throat> Travis Golden be all over another Demon Souls playthrough. <laughs> Dude, I actually haven't played Demon Souls in a while. Yeah. But it's like right now I'm also thinking about, I don't want to get into a playthrough that's going to take maybe too long, which is probably... I think I think a lot of you guys that enjoyed Dark Souls would also enjoy to see Shovel Knight, though. We'll see how that works out. But, um, yeah, that's pretty much all I had to say. It was just a very small update here uh, that I wanted to give to you guys before I, before I head out, because I'm going to, like I said, about to head out myself, meet up with some friends, have some fun, uh, chill out for a while, because uh, I've been working a whole lot this week. Also, I'm really happy about something that we did this week, which was that um, that live stream that we did on Code Vein. That's something that I want to do more of, you know, just talking about stuff, talking about a very specific topic during a live stream. Uh, I thought that live stream was a lot of fun. I, I had a lot of fun doing that one, and clearly it shows that you guys were interested was, as well um, from the results that we had on that. <clears throat> hey, Nox Tom. <laughs> Oh, Nox Tom, we might be having some news for you soon. <laughs> oh, not nothing important, dude. It's just like some some that's that's gonna be really funny if if it if it happens. <laughs> How's new studio doing, dude? New studio is awesome, but right now I'm at my house. I'm just like just chilling here. Um, but yeah, guys, that what what's under the hat? My hair. It's just messy as fuck, as you can see, so I wear the hat. See, now people are going to say, Rory, put it back on. Put the hat back on. What are you doing? I'm losing my shit is what I'm doing. Look at that. I'm crazy. Fucking crazy person. Either way, guys, uh, feedback on the topics we just discussed. Uh, leave me comments, all that stuff. I'll be checking that out. Thank you guys very much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Chris McKinnon, will you be playing The Surge? Yes, I will. As soon as I get access to it, I will be playing it. See you guys on the next one.